like to tell you now how to export your keynote presentation into a PowerPoint presentation. So if you do work here at school in Keynote, you could finish it up at home. You would go File to Export, and you could see I could save it as a QuickTime movie, I could save it as a PowerPoint, a PDF file, image file, a web file, or put it on my iPod, but I'm going to save it as a PowerPoint. I'm going to go Next. I'm now going to direct that save to make sure I put it in the right folder or in your case on a jump drive and it's all titled properly and I'm going to say export. Now I already have a version of this application I should say sorry this file but it's not updated so this will be my update file and it's going to be now in PowerPoint. Uh, it will tell me that any picture frames will be lost because it doesn't it's not supported by PowerPoint and I will lose those shadows and reflections so don't do any of that in um, Keynote until you're ready to finish your project at school and I'll say clear all and that's fine and now I'm going to minimize and look into my presentation folder and see if my PowerPoint and I'm going to double click because I do have PowerPoint on this Mac We'll open it up. It's a PowerPoint file, and it'll be the same file that I was creating in Keynote. Now, Keynote can open PowerPoint, but PowerPoint cannot open Keynote. So, when you come back to school, you could open the additional project work you did. Here it is. It has the border kind of lost some of the shadow. Let's see on the second slide. Also you'll lose probably your fancy transitions because the transitions are different in the programs. I kept the borders and I kept some of the shadows. Not bad. So now I could continue working when I'm at home. So that's how to export a keynote file to PowerPoint.